Hey everyone, <clears throat> we wanted to show you guys what we've been up to lately. <laughs> uh, the things that we've gathered and found uh, from Mother Nature. Um, excuse the uh, noise, we have model airplanes flying around us, but that's okay. Um, so, <clears throat> we're going to show you. That bowl right there is full of juniper resin. Hold one up, Kathy. It was an amazing find. I mean, just so much resin. Just amazing. I've looked online everywhere. I can't find it. I can't find it on Estee. I can't find it on Amazon. And I did research and it's an extremely rare find. Something told me to go over on this path, off of my path we were walking, and I went to this tree. Something drew me there. And it was just this mother load of this ancient resin. And the energy properties from this are really strong. So we have our um, little smudge pot filled with Sedona red sand, and we have a charcoal going. So Kathy's going to... So we broke some of these off, and we have small pieces that we're burning on this for our own incense. And then we have this also, and we ground it into powder. So any of you that know that's been around us, what smudges we are and incense burners. So it was pretty cool that we harvested our own. So you just kind of drop them in there. I don't know if you can show it, Corey. And the smell is insane and the properties from it are quite amazing it's for psychic abilities communicating um with the dead and healing purification it goes it's the oldest known uh, ritual incense around documented it's a really sweet um it's amazing yeah it's spicy it's just an amazing smell. And then we get some of this and then we ground it into powder and you, know, you can take the powder and do that. And the powder you could actually sprinkle on your smudge material like sage, juniper. So then we have um, this here we got in Grand Canyon. In the Grand Canyon. We got to the Grand Canyon right at the perfect time. The sage was had flowered um, and it was just prime for picking. You know us being big smudgers. So we asked and it was given and we gave thanks in the harvesting. The sage, I have to say, is the best sage I have ever used. Um, and the juniper resin is just kind of blowing my mind away. I can't wait to do some work with that energetically wise and meditation wise and psychically. So we made Smudge sticks um, out of Sedona juniper right there in the front. And the other one, uh, there it is, is uh, Grand Canyon sage with New Mexico juniper mixed in. And it's big hunk of chunks. It's just amazing. What That's got. just a huge chunk of juniper resin. So I wish you guys could smell this. It's absolutely amazing. Like between the different elements and the different places we harvest them and the different properties they are and then doing the research to find out how they were brought to us. So anyway, we wanted to share with you a little bit of our finds and what we're... Wish doing. you all could smell it. See you later. <laughs>